Dhanush Howitzer, India's Precision Artillery Powerhouse. Welcome to Military Weapons Channel. Today, we're taking a closer look at a remarkable piece of artillery, the Dhanush Howitzer. The Dhanush, which means bow in Sanskrit, is a true symbol of Indian engineering and firepower. Join us as we explore what makes this 155mm towed howitzer a game changer. The Dhanush Howitzer is a product of the Indian Ordnance Factory Board. It was developed to replace older artillery systems in the Indian Army's arsenal. The Danish is fitted with a 155mm slash L45 ordnance. It is longer than the L39mm ordnance of the FH-77B. Hence the Danish has a longer range of fire. It is compatible with all standard NATO 155mm ammunition. One of the standout features of the Dhanush Howitzer is its versatility. It can fire a variety of shells, making it suitable for a wide range of combat scenarios. From high explosive rounds to specialized munitions, the Dhanush can adapt to different mission requirements with ease. It fires high explosive, smoke, illuminating, and cargo shells. A standard high explosive shell has a maximum range of 38 kilometers. It is also compatible with the US Excalibur Extended Range GPS guided shells. These have a range of up to 40 kilometers and are accurate out to 5M. The Danish has a split trail carriage. However, unlike most other field howitzers, it lacks a central plate. Still though, it is capable of wide angles of traverse and elevation. The howitzer is fitted with a hydraulic crane, which loads ammunition. This crane picks up a pack of three shells and loads them into the loading tray of the howitzer. Charges are loaded manually. Though the shell and the propellant charge are rammed mechanically using an automatic load assisting system. It loads the howitzer at any elevation. Unfortunately, there is no option for manual loading. If the power unit fails, the crew can use manual hydraulic pumps in order to continue operation. The Danish can launch a burst of three shells within 15 seconds. So in theory, a crew of two can emplace the howitzer and fire at a rate of up to 12 rounds per minute. Sustained rate of fire is one round per minute. This howitzer is operated by a crew of six to eight. It takes only around one to two minutes for the crew to emplace the howitzer or to leave the firing position. The Danish uses auxiliary power unit, which develops 127 horsepower. It is installed in a fairing carried atop of the front of the carriage. Maximum road speed of this howitzer is around 18 kilometers per hour, though auto propulsion capability is typically used only for short distances. Normally, this artillery system is towed by a 6x6 military truck. Recently, India adopted an Ashok Leland Fat Artillery Tractor with 6x6 configuration. This tractor has additional cabs for the gun crew. Also, it carries ammunition for this howitzer. Furthermore, there is a hydraulic hoist for self-loading and unloading of ammunition. The Danish can be also towed by most other 6x6 military trucks. Despite its firepower, the Dhanush is designed to be highly portable and mobile. It can be quickly deployed and relocated, adding to its tactical advantage. Like any advanced weapon system, the Dhanush Howitzer is not static. Ongoing research and development aim to enhance its capabilities further. Future upgrades may include improved automation, extended range, and enhanced digital connectivity, making the Dhanush even more formidable. In conclusion, the Dhanush Howitzer represents a significant leap in artillery technology. Its versatility, range, and precision make it a valuable asset for the Indian military, and its potential for future enhancements promises even greater effectiveness. If you found this video informative, please like, share, and subscribe to Military Weapons for more in-depth explorations of cutting-edge military technology and innovations. Stay tuned for our next video.